it's too much um, snow skiing basically all right uh, so let's look at it uh, first of all I'm thinking this is way too far all right maybe right here so I've got to copy that into my last frame let's see Actually, I liked it better earlier, so let me undo that. Let me play it. Yeah. Okay, we need to do the same thing with the other. It's not doing it properly. So right here, it's good. And I'm going to add more on the crossing. Don't worry. Right here, this is where I want to get a little bit more of it. And I'll change the feed after, don't worry. Let's change that to copy to the first one. Remember, you always have to copy first to last or last to first. All right, Ollie, we're not going to work very well for you. Let's look at it in a wireframe. Yeah, it's better. The crossing is still weird, and the full is still weird, but that's not a big deal. We can deal with that right now, actually. Okay, on the crossing right here. Okay. That is not crossing enough on that leg right there. This is not high enough. We'll get to increase that a little bit. All right. Right here, yes, yeah. much better. Might be a little bit too much of the stretch right here. So let me bring it right here. So I'm going to make a key right there. I'm going to copy that key to the first one, too. Right here. Let's click on four so we can see the wireframe. See how it works out for us. Yeah, better. All right. Now let's look at it right there, uh, you guys. Uh, keywords. So the first one, yeah, that looks good. I like it. The crossing, it's pushing nice. Now the crossing here is okay. I think we can move it a little bit more. Exaggerate a little bit, frankly. Right there. Let's look at it. Yeah, that works better for me. Let's put it on the wireframe so we can see it. And that works much better for me. Okay, well, let's look at the foot a little bit, and then we'll get to shoulders and arms. We'll do arms first, and then we'll do shoulders. Uh, on the foot, it's the roll of the foot. This is tricky. So let's look at it. That's doing good right here. That's good, actually. Not too bad at all. Right here, and it's pushing in the first one, going up. Not too bad. And the second one right here, rolling from the tip, the back to the tip. Okay, that one might go a little bit too much through the floor. Yeah. And the only way to fix that up... Let me see that just a second if I can adjust it a little bit right here. Let me try that just a second. Let's look at it. Yeah, that's a little bit better. I like that better. I don't go through it as much. Okay, I'll be good enough for that for now. Okay, now let's look into um, the arms. The arms are the opposite of what you're doing. So, basically you select it here, and you are going to put it in the opposite, which is up front forward. Bring it down. Uh, 
I went too far. So right here will be much better. It's going to make it work pretty fast anyway. I'm not so close to the body maybe. And we'll key that here. I'll do it twice. I remember that story again. Yeah, it's just mine. Because they were attached to certain things, you guys. That's why. Anyway. We're back. We should be back soon, really quickly, actually. Right here. And I'll click on one. S, I mean, to make one key. Now I get to 15, and it's just the inverse, basically. And I'll just put it back right here. Make a key. All right, we basically copy that key now into the last. Right there. Now you got your character working. Okay. Now we'll do the same thing with the other arm. Let me delete all that. I know it's going to have the same problem, so it's not a big deal. I'll deal with that right now. Alright, and that's got to go in the back anyway. No, oh, too close. Let me key that, and it'll come back. So, I should not even bother uh, to do a good pose. It's all about key poses. That's why I made you guys do some drawing at the beginning of the semester. So you understand everything is about key poses uh, in animation. All right, you guys, doesn't get much deeper than that. Okay, hold on here. Oh, I should have deleted that, which I didn't, I guess. All right. Right here. And at 15, we do the inverse. We'll bring it up front. Right, and not too close to the body, not too far. And that looks pretty good. We'll key that. We make sure we go and copy the first one into the last key, as usual. Okay, you guys? Uh, let's uh, look a little bit at it. Not too bad. It's a little high right here on the second hand, but that's that will work for us. Let me try to bring it a little bit down. Frankly, it's a little too much. The animator says it's never too much. That's all I have to say. Uh, animators always think they can put more into it, uh, which in cartoon situation I would have to agree big time on it. In video game, you want to be careful. Uh, as a video game guy, always be careful and putting too much into it so it doesn't get too cartoonish. Okay, let's play it. Unless you're doing a cartoonish game, obviously. Let's play that. My friend. Not too, too bad. Okay, uh, we are going to do the shoulders next, basically. Okay, now we need to get a little bit of action um, on the shoulder situation. All right, you guys, uh, right here. Uh, and that's uh, as to do, um, uh, basically, uh, to give more rotation, up and down, uh, and sideways also. Uh, so it'll look, put, uh, we'll put those, uh, those rotation around 7 for now. Let's look at it right here. We basically are going to want to uh, go a little bit like that, for example, on it. Okay, you guys, incline against it right here. Okay, so to be able to do that anyway, we need to come right here, first kit, and then go on seven. Give him a slight turn of it right here. And we're gonna going to copy that. To get it back at 15 like that, basically, right here. And after that, around 23, 22, we are going to do another weight. 